and then you can get people into cars and obviously guitars. That's yeah. a different kind of subset when you think about it. Yeah, yeah. There's some places that would sell a lot of nice guitars, you know. But this this is just another thing. People come from all over the world to come here. Yeah, it's a destination. So it is the 30th of September. Hey, you guys want to be on a video? Okay, I'm just going to just show you what Kathy's making me. Ta-da! Salads, guys. How sweet is that? How sweet? Not that. But that. And this looks like it's going to be mine, right, Kath? That one's yours, yeah. Sweet. So where's my uh, clutch belt? You've got your own cash shoes somewhere. Yes, I know, but my... Um... Uh, I don't know that. Your dressing? Yes. Where's my Maybe dressing? Where's... Well, maybe in my room. Let's take a look. I'll show you my dressing. Uh oh, Kath, I don't see it. So you you have multiple brands. Uh oh, I don't see my dressing anyway. <clears throat> I'm sure it's hidden someplace. All right, let me show you what I've been working on, cats. One of the things, anyway. All right, <clears throat> I got a nice and neat this porch looks, guys. Check it out. Don't look at that stuff. That stuff's got to be put away yet. But, uh, no spider webs, no spider eggs, all the way down here. This looks really nice. No spider webs, no spider webs, spider webs. And of course, you guys remember I had uh, Genesis Builders put these uh, spindles in and painted the posts. And the, the risers under here. Does this not look gorgeous? No spider webs anywhere, guys. I mean, this thing was just totally covered with web. Drove me nuts. So I swept it all off, wiped it all the way. And I think it looks just gorgeous. I'm totally amazed. So that was one of my jobs that I worked on in the few days that's passed it just looks so clean <laughs> finally <laughs> so the plan is never to have yeah there's gonna be cat food here all the time but never to have blankets and stuff like that or pillows maybe a pillow here for the cats but otherwise no and it gets uh, maintained I'll have to maintain it keep it clean what else have I worked on uh, my sandals I got them all glued up looking nice my feet look terrible, but, and look, I have my, hey guys, in Andy Weingarten, I have my uh, my sling on. Ah, so I did go to the doctor. I did get my uh, rotator cuff um, surgery uh, st uh, stitches out finally. That happened yesterday. I talked, I'm just checking out this motorcycle. It sounds like a motorcycle. It is. Nice bike, Harley. And um, I asked him, how important is this sling? And he said, well, it's important right after surgery that, uh, you know, you don't undo the surgery. But um, he says, if you're sitting down, you know, and you got armrest or something like that, you really don't need it. Or if you're in bed, you really don't need it sleeping. Um, and you know other times but uh i wear <coughs> a real good portion of the day now uh, i did sleep without it and the problem was my arm slid off of the armrest of the recliner and it hurt so bad this morning i was in pain and then i had uh, uh physical therapy therapy phyllis physical therapy and uh she really ran me through the works and i'm learning to relax it so she can actually pull it way you know the range of motion as much as possible i just want to take a quick peek at my mgb here guys look at that baby it's in the dark Shh, i think he's trying to sleep keep it down i can't wait to work on that so here's the plan i don't know what's going on with uh, my corvette it's still up on the uh, uh uh the lift the car lift and it's taking up my space so what I plan on doing now is get it out of there. Get it out of this shop, 
how am I going to get it up there? I don't know. Maybe tow it with the car or the truck, put a strap underneath it and pull it. Just get it out of there and then get the MG out of here and put the MG back into here onto the lift and I get to work on that all winter. How about that? So I'm happy there. Uh, believe it or not, it's the 30th of September, 2021. It is a Thursday and <clears throat> the girls actually swam in here. Chrissy, Kathy, and Allie actually swam in here. I don't know if the grandkids did, but and <clears throat> stirred it up, stirred up the water nicely, and still running just to keep the chemicals motiv motivating. I can see the dogs been swimming in it because I see hair in there. It'll be, but it still looks pretty clear. The weather turned out really nice today. And it's supposed to have a couple more days of that, and then it's supposed to turn sour. Let's turn south. Um, well, yeah, just look at that. Nice and clean. <clears throat> now, what's that on the bottom? Well, it's a toy. Way on the bottom. I don't know if you can see the bottom. Right there is a ring next to the drain. So I see it's a toy. Anyway, uh, hey, will you look at that? A horse trailer over there. A horse trailer. So it moved from way in the back. To over here and I'm gonna leave it in this area and for the sole purpose of Jen training the baby to go in and out um, uh, Perrin is the baby this chair is wet by the way how do I know because I sat in it it's damp I got my butt all wet my buttocks I don't like wet buttocks but uh, yeah there's Perrin out there I don't know if you guys can see out there but uh, Perrin is hanging out with I think it's his mom but um, the owner, or the uh, person that was going to buy it, um, had to back out, which is okay, you know, because she's got a, one of our other uh, gelding, Hopper, and he's doing really good there, and he's got a professional uh, dressage uh, trainer training him, so uh, he's, he's a rock star. Hopper is a rock star. Um, I'll show you some pictures of him when he was at our farm. I think we sold them at like a year, year and a half old, maybe two, I can't remember. But uh, <clears throat> this one was, was going to be his mate in, as a driving team, but uh, um, he's gonna spend some time here. <laughs> Which is good because now I get to see him more and uh, watch him and Jen work their magic in that trailer. Uh, in the end, that trailer is gonna be parked behind this, wait a minute, this barn over here, uh, this barn. That's the shop. This is the horse barn here. Uh, here. Oh no, wait, man. This is the horse barn. I can't really see that well with this into this camera lens. This is the horse barn. This is the shop. And this is the garage where the MGB is sitting right now. Anyway, <clears throat> I know I'm rambling on and on and on, guys, but uh, I haven't been posting anything. I have so many videos just sitting there that I'm prepping to be uploaded into YouTube. I'm so far behind, guys. And then, as time goes uh, by, I post them, the YouTube videos, I put links on Facebook. So, again, as you, when you see this video, it's gonna be well past September 30th, which is today. So, yeah, it's crazy. Um, <clears throat> I see some tomatoes still hanging out here. And uh, a couple of, all, I think all three plants might have some tomatoes yet. Uh, the grapes, this one here is pretty much done. I ate 90% of those. Three words. Delicious. Delicious. Or if you want to, if you're dyslexic, it's delicious. Delicious. Um, James Climax is the one that uh, pretty much taught me that. So, um, and then a couple of fictional stories. I did get a call from uh, Kent Greening. Kent Greening, uh, thanks for the call. Had a good chat with you. Uh, um, yeah. Kent Greening. It's been a long time since I've talked to you. You, and then I also got a call from David Meineker. Dave Meineker. Haven't talked to you for a while. Dave Meineker. Be cool. Old Dave. Yep. It's been a long, long time since I talked to those guys. So, anyway... <clears throat> Them, that, this grape here was delicious. Uh, you have to have special 
you have to know how to eat them. They're conquered grapes. You can't really eat the peelings. My story, my video, my story. You can't really eat the peeling, so I just squeeze the juice out of that and suck the uh, the meat out and spit out the pits. Delicious, and it's still producing, not producing, but there's still fruit on there. Um, every day, every so often, I go out there and gobble them up. So, so good, so good. Beans are still uh, coming out of these uh, uh, raised beds, raised box garden. Yes, and anyway, I thought I'd throw a video in here um, I'm still loading uploading or preparing the videos from September this is will be probably be the last video in September so I uh, thought I just you know give a little heads up but hey I'm still alive and things are happening uh, fall is coming guys um, the leaves are falling off the trees they're churning colors um, the walnut trees they're coming off, off pretty quickly the walnuts the nuts are dropping like crazy and you can hear you know someone will drop on the road and roll into the road and cars will run over it, it sounds like little firecrackers popping driveways just full of them uh they're black walnuts so the meat is very very minimal but so unbelievably tasty it's an explosion in your mouth just a little dinky piece will explode in your mouth these doves flying up ahead love doves <clears throat> And uh, I intend on harvesting a bunch of those and putting it in the, the drying crib. And someday I'll crack them open and to get the fruit out. And... Oh, baba. So that's today, guys. Um, again, the 30th of September, 2021. It's a Thursday, and it's just a knockdown, drag out, beautiful day. Unbelievable. Um, I can't wait till I get rid of this sling, guys. It's I'm supposed to wear it for another four weeks. So it's a total of six weeks. And then I lose that and then have the um, physical therapists just reef on it. And it's so painful, but you have to learn to relax and then let them really, I guess, stretch the, uh, the tendons, I guess, you know, because they had a, I'm thinking, in my mind they take the the worn broken tendons and pull it back and then fasten it back to your shoulder bone <clears throat> technical term shoulder bone um, medical technical term but uh and then of course you have to s stretch it and maybe stretch the muscles i don't know but uh self-locking guys self-locking so that's the deal. So today I have, last night I did maybe uh, 15 videos, you know, the, the thumbnails. I have, to, I have to make thumbnails for these things. And probably 15 of them. And I probably have another 15 to go. So tonight I'll get those done, the thumbnails, and then I'll start loading them on uh, YouTube. And then I'll uh, get out of my lazy funk my funk is lazy and <clears throat> I got to get out of that and uh, yeah by the time you see this video there'll be a bunch of videos <laughs> ahead of it the last video that I posted on YouTube was September 2 and today is September September 30 so yeah all right guys take it easy be cool and again check out that wonderful handiwork of Genesis builders so I'll do a before and after pictures on Facebook that you can see and maybe attach it onto a, a YouTube video too for you guys to see all right take it easy I shall see you later bye